Today, I'll show you how to loop and extend your music tracks in Adobe Audition. Biddle MCOM. Hey guys, it's David O with Biddle MCOM. Thanks for coming back to the channel. We are today in Adobe Audition and we're looking at the loop and the remix function in Adobe Audition. So, just to get everything out of the way, if you want an easy way to extend your music track to whatever length you want, skip to the remix section of this tutorial right now. But first, I'm going to start in the loop function. So I've got a music track here. I'm going to double click it to take it into waveform. And what I need to do here, before I can use the loop feature, I have to actually know what I'm going to loop. Let's play the track back. All right, so I'll have something in here at the beginning. And if you have trouble looping music, uh, it's kind of the conventional way. I have a tutorial for that you can check out right here. Uh, but it's not really that hard, especially if you use spectral frequency display. We're looking for the big strike, the big beat. And so we'll go ahead and throw a marker there by hitting the letter M on our keyboard. Now I'm listening for that same point in the audio again to come up. I think there's one here. I think there's one here. Let's put an M there and I'm going to highlight it. And then I'm going to turn on my loop playback feature. Hit play. See the loops. A little off. Take it to the next one. So we're on beat, uh, and it's got a little bit of character, so I like it. So we'll use this. So now what I have done, instead of in the past, now I would have to take this, copy it, go to the end, paste it, go to the end of this one and paste it over and over and over to make it meet what I wanted to lengthwise. Now with the loop feature, I don't have to do that. But what I do need to do is trim off all this fat here. So everything outside of the markers that I've established, I'm cutting it off. So now let me jump back in multi-track. Shorten my track here. Now, I've all, now all I've got is this little loopable piece right here. It's the one we just listened to. Okay, so what I need to do right here is right click on the audio track, go down to loop. Now it's gonna add this little icon here. I'll expand the screen so you can see it maybe. This little icon here, it's just the little loop feature, just like our little loop playback here. But now watch what happens. When I take my cursor to the end, instead of just the red bracketed arrow, it's got the little loop icon on it. So now I can click and drag this out as long as I want. And all it's doing is repeating that piece that we have selected in multi or in waveform. It's just cutting it out where I don't have to copy and paste it. Now when we play back, So now when I play back, it's looped and it's perfect and it's beautiful, but it is because of the hard work we did at the beginning, making sure that we were looping on the beat. Okay, that was the little more challenging way, but it's still a very cool feature in Adobe Audition. Now let's talk about Remix. Remix is the reason why everybody's here because it's fast and it's easy and it's pretty intuitive and it's a pretty incredible thing. And it's available in Premiere Pro too. Check out another tutorial for that on my page. Anyway, here we go. I'm going to click on the file. I'm going to right click the file. I'm going to go down to Remix, Enable Remix. Then in my property panel, it's going to pull up on the left hand side. If you don't see your property panel, it's under Window. Properties, select it, make sure it's checkmarked, and it'll be over here somewhere on this panel here next to your match loudness and diagnostic pane. So what I need to do here, if I go down to target duration, right now it's set at about 35 seconds because that is the length of my track. So if I wanna make this a minute and a half long, I can add a one right there, hit tab. It's going to calculate it and holy cow, it has made my track a minute and a half long. And it's as simple as that. All these little squiggly lines are the cut points that it made. Let's listen and see if it sounds nice and clean. Remix. 
remix is unbelievable. It's super intuitive, and it even works really well if you have lyrics in the track that you're trying to remix. It does a great job, and it's available standard in Adobe Audition and Premiere Pro. Great for podcasts, radio commercials, uh, any jingles you can think of, any internet usage, TV usage. It's such an incredible tool, and it's right here for free in Adobe Audition. If you have any questions, call, text, or email if you know me. If not, leave them down in the comments. Thanks for watching, guys.